Ever thought about starting your own podcast? Imagined your voice resonating with listeners worldwide? Podcasting has exploded in popularity, becoming a go-to medium for sharing stories, expertise, and unique perspectives. With millions tuning in daily, the potential to reach an expansive, engaged audience like never before is ripe for the picking. And the best part? There's room at the table for everyone. Well, you've come to the right place to turn that dream into reality. Let's dive into the world of podcasting. First things first, you need an idea. A great podcast starts with a unique, engaging concept. It's the lifeblood of your podcast, the very essence of it. But how do you come up with one? Well, take a look around. Inspiration is everywhere. It could be a book you're reading, a conversation you've had, or even a movie you've watched. Then it's time to narrow it down. Focus on the aspects that you find most intriguing. Maybe it's the untold stories of your city's underground music scene or the daily lives of the world's top chefs. The point is, it should be something that captivates you, something you can't wait to dive into and share with the world. And don't forget, the best ideas often come from your own experiences and interests. So tap into your passions, your curiosities. Remember, your big idea should be something you're passionate about as enthusiasm resonates with listeners. Next, let's equip you for success. You don't need a professional studio, but quality equipment is crucial. When it comes to podcasting, there are three pieces of equipment you simply can't do without. The first is a good microphone. A quality microphone is the cornerstone of any podcast setup. It's your primary tool for capturing your voice and presenting it to your listeners. The type of mic you choose can greatly affect the sound quality of your podcast. So investing in a good one is key. Don't worry, you don't have to break the bank. There are plenty of affordable options out there that still deliver top-notch quality. Now let's move on to headphones. You might wonder why you need headphones for podcasting. In essence, they help you monitor your audio while recording and editing. They let you hear exactly what your listeners will hear and trust me, you want that insight. Look for a pair that's comfortable, durable, and delivers clear, balanced sound. Next up is the pop filter. This little piece of equipment often gets overlooked, but it can make a world of difference. A pop filter is a screen that's placed between you and your microphone. It's designed to reduce or eliminate the popping sounds that can occur when you pronounce certain words, especially those with P's and B's. This helps to ensure a smoother, more professional sound. Let's not forget the importance of sound quality. In the world of podcasting, content is king, but sound quality is definitely queen. Listeners can forgive a lot of things, but poor sound quality isn't usually one of them. It can be distracting, annoying, and can even drive listeners away. So make it a priority to ensure your podcast sounds as good as it possibly can. Remember, your equipment is not just tools, but the extension of your voice and your brand. It's worth taking the time to research and invest in quality gear that will help you produce the best sounding podcast possible. With the right equipment, you're well on your way to producing a professional sounding podcast. Now that you're equipped, you'll need software to record and edit your podcast. In the world of podcasting, software is your best friend. It's the tool that takes your raw audio and transforms it into a polished professional podcast. Let's delve into some options, both free and paid, that you can use to record and edit your podcast. Commencing with recording software, Audacity is a free, open-source software that's perfect for beginners. It's user-friendly and offers basic recording and editing features. On the other hand, if you're willing to invest a bit, Adobe Audition is a top-notch choice. It's a comprehensive tool that provides advanced recording and editing options. You can seamlessly reduce noise, edit multi-track, and even repair audio. But let's not forget GarageBand, a free software for Mac users. It's intuitive, easy to use, and comes with a plethora of built-in sound effects and music loops. Now let's shift gears and talk about editing software. This is where the magic happens. This is where you remove those awkward pauses, those ums and ahs, and those unwanted background noises. If you're just starting out, consider using a Litu. It's a user-friendly podcast maker that automates audio cleanup and adds your theme music. It's like having a little audio genie at your fingertips. For those seeking more control and precision in their editing process, Hindenburg Journalist Pro is a premium option. It offers advanced features like voice profiler, 
which automatically levels out your voice across the podcast, and soundbite management for easy organization of your audio clips. Remember, the software you choose should align with your needs and skill level. If you're a beginner, start with user-friendly software and gradually progress to more advanced tools as you become comfortable. And don't forget, no matter how great your content is, poor audio quality can deter listeners. So take your time to learn your chosen software and practice your editing skills. The world of podcast software may seem complex, but once you find the right tools, it's a game changer. The right software will make your podcast sound polished and professional. You've got your equipment, your software, and your big idea. Now, where do you host your podcast? Hosting your podcast is the equivalent of finding a home for your audio files on the internet. It's where your podcast episodes live and from where they're distributed to various listening platforms like Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and Google Podcasts. There's a myriad of hosting platforms out there, and choosing the right one can be a bit of a challenge, but don't worry, we'll walk you through some of the key considerations. First off, you want to consider the size and scale of your podcast. Are you a hobbyist or a business? If you're just starting, you might want a platform that's easy to use and budget-friendly. But if you're a business or have big aspirations, you might need more advanced features and analytics. Next, you want to consider the platform's distribution capabilities. Some platforms automatically distribute your podcast to all major listening apps, which can save you a ton of time. Others might require manual distribution, which can be a bit more labor-intensive. Then, consider the platform's analytics. How detailed are they? Do they give you insight into who's listening, when they're listening, and where they're listening from? This information can be crucial for understanding your audience and tailoring your content. Lastly, consider the platform's customer service. If you run into a problem or have a question, it's important to have a responsive and helpful support team. There are several platforms out there that offer a balance of these elements. Platforms like Podbean, Buzzsprout, and Libsyn have made a name for themselves in the podcasting world, each with their unique features and pricing structures. Remember, the best hosting platform for you depends on your specific needs and goals. Take the time to research, compare, and choose the platform that best aligns with your podcast's vision. Choosing the right platform can help your podcast reach as many ears as possible. So make your choice wisely and happy podcasting. You're almost ready to hit record, but how will people find your podcast? This is where the magic of promotion comes into play. It's all about getting your podcast out there so it can be discovered by potential listeners. One of the most potent tools in your promotional arsenal is social media. It's practically tailor-made for podcast promotion. Platforms like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, and even TikTok offer a chance to engage with your audience and create a buzz around your content. Consider creating engaging posts that tease upcoming episodes, share behind-the-scenes content, or even host live Q&A sessions with your listeners. Let's not forget the power of collaborations. Teaming up with other podcasters can help you tap into their audience and vice versa. Guest appearances can create a win-win situation where both parties reach a broader audience. Also, consider partnering with influencers in your niche. Their endorsement can bring a significant boost to your listener numbers. Another effective strategy is leveraging the power of search engine optimization, or SEO. SEO isn't just for websites, it's also crucial for podcasts. By optimizing your podcast title, description, and episode titles with keywords, you can improve your visibility in search results. Use tools like Google's Keyword Planner to discover what potential listeners are searching for and incorporate those keywords into your content. Email marketing is also worth mentioning. Building an email list allows you to connect directly with your listeners. You can send out weekly newsletters, episode updates, or exclusive content to your subscribers. This strategy helps build a loyal listener base and boosts engagement. Lastly, don't underestimate the power of word of mouth. Encourage your listeners to share your podcast with their friends, family, and social circles. You might even consider creating a referral program to incentivize sharing. Remember, promoting your podcast is an ongoing process. It's not something you do once and then forget about. Consistency, creativity, and engagement are key to growing your listener base and turning your podcast into a successful venture. 
With a solid promotion strategy, your podcast will be reaching eager listeners in no time. So, you're equipped. You've got your software, hosting platform, and promotion strategy. You're ready to start your podcast journey. We've covered the essentials, the right gear, top-of-the-line software, the best platforms for hosting, and ways to promote your new show. All these pieces come together to create the perfect podcast puzzle. But remember, the most important piece is you, your voice, your perspective. Remember, the world needs your unique voice and perspective. So go ahead and start your podcasting journey today.